Hi everyone, Andy Yu here, award-winning uh, stockbroker, trader and portfolio manager. Okay, so today we have a very interesting story about this Hong Kong stock that actually went down uh, more than 70%. You know, if you watch my previous video, you will know that uh, there's this uh, Hong Kong scam that's going on. There's some of these stocks, they will just uh, drop more than 70% in just one day. Okay, so many people, they do not know, they thought that, you know, uh, when it drop uh, 10%, then it's good time to actually uh, get in to buy the stock cheap. But, okay, uh, they, they didn't expect that the stock actually went down for like all the way up to 70 to 80%. Okay, so the story is this, okay, uh, we have this uh, client that is actually, uh, you know, uh, I don't know where he get this uh, tip from, okay, or maybe uh, how he noticed uh, this counter. So what happened is uh, he called in and want to place a trade on this uh, counter and uh, because uh, he cannot key in by themselves, okay, so so if you are trading with uh, poems, right, okay, uh, you will notice that there's some counters, you know, especially Hong Kong uh, penny stock counter, right, Okay, you are restricted to place order online. Okay, so this is a safety feature where the company actually uh, help you to you know uh, filter out some of these stocks. Okay, and you know uh, make sure that uh, before you buy, okay, uh, you must go through a broker. So maybe the broker will actually uh, advise you. So my team actually uh, advise uh, you know to advise this client that uh, you know if that you know this counter might have some risk, might have some risk. So we actually uh, you know. Uh, share with him uh, you know even my previous video on on this uh, penny stock scam okay and also uh, you know after that the client still insists to buy so you know we are thinking should we key in the order okay so so after that you know the client said that he actually have the money inside okay? he actually have the money inside the account so what's the reason why uh, we do not let him buy right so that is uh, also some some uh, difficulty we face uh, so so at the end, okay, uh, we actually uh, discussed for a while, you know, uh, and you know, there's like so many calls coming in. The client uh, insists to uh, want to key in the order, want to buy, uh, want to buy the stocks. Yeah, we are in a very difficult uh, position. So during a time uh, when the client want to key in the order, the, the price is around four dollars. Okay, and he want to buy around, he want to buy about forty five thousand shares, and that will cost about thirty two thousand uh, Sing dollar. Okay, so thirty two thousand Sing dollar, and then you know his account only have around uh, twenty four thousand Sing dollar. And we're thinking, you know, uh, should we help him to buy? Should we key the order for him? So, uh, so after thinking, you know, uh, like for a while, you know, and have some discussion talking about the risk that the the you know our our team actually have. Okay, so in in case the stock actually went all the way down and the client did not expect this to happen, you know, what if? What if there's a loss, a big loss, okay? So after thinking about it, okay, we said that okay, maybe if you buy lesser, okay, if you buy lesser, maybe, you know, we can let him, uh, you know, buy some of the shares, okay, not not the full amount because we try to protect him, okay? So again, you know, he called a few times and what happened is, you know, uh, when we, we saw it, the share actually uh, went down. The share actually went down from $4, okay, next moment it become like, dollars 42 cents and that's where you know uh you know uh, okay we're thinking you know to tell him that he's actually two dollar 42 cents now and this is what we are talking about and this is like real really dangerous okay and this counter is really dangerous and it is happening it is falling right now and at the end of the day the client still said hey maybe we sh uh it's it's a better time to buy so so at the end of the day the client uh, insists to to key in the order at you know three dollars or better okay three dollars or better so so after a while okay uh you know and reducing the size discussing with the clients okay so the client actually want, wanted to buy at around uh one dollar uh 90 90 over cents so so managed to get it at one dollar 97 cents okay and that is actually when the share price actually falls 50 58 percent okay so if you can see you know the share actually dropped about 58 percent it's actually fall a lot already, right? Okay, and chances are it should not be falling uh, more, right? Okay, 
So after a while, so and during the time, it was like, you know, like uh, 10 minutes or 15 minutes to closing, okay? It's almost closing already. So it's already dropped 58%, you know, how low can it go, right? Okay, so that's what we think as well, okay? But, okay, but at the end, okay, what happened is when the market actually closed, okay, well, when the market actually closed, so you can see that the share price actually end at 99 cents. Okay, the share price actually ended at 99 cents. Okay, so the day high, okay, the day high is at $4.59. Day high is at $4.59 and the day low, okay, is actually at 99 cents. So you can actually see that, you know, this is, uh, you know, this is what we call the penny stock scam, all right? And after watching this video, I hope that, you know, uh, you get an experience uh, what is this uh, penny stock scam that we are actually talking about. And what is the danger and you know what happened with this uh the overall uh, uh the whole uh, ordeal this this whole day you know where the clients actually wanted to buy like 30 32 000 worth of stocks and then he actually get in you know at this uh like a like a twenty thousand cheaper so we actually helped him to save uh 20 over thousand cheaper but uh, because you know uh, he insists on buying okay instead of buying uh, at the end and he still lose by another 50 percent okay and that is like you know he lost like almost a uh, five thousand dollars within uh, 15 minutes okay five thousand dollars within 15 minutes okay so if we have not you know delay the the trade we have not you know uh, com try to convince him to get out okay i think he will probably lose like you know uh like 80 percent of thirty two thousand. that's is around twenty five thousand twenty five thousand dollars Okay, so I hope that you can you know learn something from this video. I hope that you know if you got any friends, the best is you can share with them this video to tell uh, to warn them that uh, this is actually happening. Especially uh, if you are trading uh, this kind of uh, penny stocks, especially if you are you know uh, getting some tips from some people that you are you don't really know. Okay, uh, hope you can actually warn them a little bit. All right. So thank you for watching this. I hope to see you in our next video. Remember to uh, like uh, this video, subscribe this video, and hit the notification bell so that when we have the next video, you'll be able to receive it. Thank you for watching this. We'll see you next time.